to his name. We're singing glory to his name. Glory to his name. There to my heart was the blood applied. Singing glory to his name. I am so wondrously saved from sin. Jesus so sweetly abides within. There at the cross where he took me in. Singing glory to his name. We're singing. Precious name. Glory to his name. There to my heart was the blood applied. Singing glory to his name. Oh, precious fountain that saves from sin. I am so glad I have entered in. There Jesus saves me and keeps me clean. Singing glory to his name. We're singing to his name, precious name. Glory to his name. There to my heart was the blood applied. Singing glory to Come to this fountain so rich and sweet. Cast thy poor soul at the Savior's feet. Plunge in today and be made complete. Singing glory to his name. We're singing glory to his name, precious name. Glory to his name. There to my heart was the blood applied. Singing glory to his name. We're singing glory to his name, precious name. Glory to his name. There to my heart was the blood applied. Singing glory to his name. We're going to sing, Are You Washed in the Blood? Have you been to Jesus for the cleansing power? Are you washed in the blood of the Lamb? Are you fully trusting in His grace this hour? Are you washed in the blood of the Lamb? Oh, are you washed in the blood? In the soul, cleansing blood of the Lamb. Are your garments spotless? Are they white as snow? Are you washed in the blood of the Lamb? Are you walking daily by the Savior's side? Are you washed in the blood of the Lamb? Do you rest each moment in the crucified? Are you washed in the blood of the Lamb? Or are you washed in the blood, in the soul, cleansing blood of the Lamb? Are your garments spotless? Are they white as snow? Are you washed? In the blood of the Lamb Lay aside the garments That are stained with sin And be washed in the blood of the Lamb There's a fountain flowing For the soul unclean Oh, be washed in the blood of the Lamb Oh, are you washed? In the blood, in the soul, cleansing.
and blood of the Lamb. Are your garments spotless? Are they white as snow? Are you washed in the blood of the Lamb? Oh, are you washed in the blood, in the soul? In the blood of the Lamb One, one, one One way to heaven One, one, one One way to God One, one, one One way to heaven It's a high and a holy way Jesus is that one One way Jesus is that one, one way to God. Jesus is that one, one way to heaven. It's a high and a holy way. One Lord, one faith, one baptism. One Lord, one faith, one baptism. One Lord, one faith, one baptism. Jesus is our all and all. That's why there's one, one, one. One way to heaven. One, one, one. One way to God. One, one, one. One way to heaven. It's a high and a holy way. Give the Lord a hand, praise. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus, for all you have done. Thank you, Lord. See, God see all that without talking. Look, he opened out his mouth. And his what? Humiliation. And his what? His was taken away. Uh -huh. Who life. should? Life. For his life was taken from the what? Uh -huh. And the eunuch said, and answered, Philip. He said, I pray thee, of whom speak it, the prophet, this of himself, of himself or some other man. Mm -hmm. Then Philip opened his mouth and began at the same what? Scripture. What did he preach? He preached unto him Jesus. <laughs> no, he preached Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Jesus. This is what he was preaching. He was preaching the gospel. Amen. Going to all the world and preach the what? If you preach the gospel, they get baptized. So this is what he was preaching. He was preaching Jesus, and as they went on their way, they came to a certain what? Water. And the eunuch said, see, here is water. What do hinder me to be what? Baptized. <laughs> he said, what's stopping you? What's your problem? <laughs> you see that? So you think baptism is the water only. What about the baptism of the Holy Ghost? What about the baptism of fire in your life? The problems. and You got to be baptized with fire. And guess what? God let things happen to you. You think it's bad. You're crying. You're doing all kinds of stuff. You don't know. You did the best thing because God see everything. Yes. He's seen stuff before you seen it. Yes. But he loved you so much he protected you from it and you didn't even know it. And you will find out later why you was like that. And you're going to praise God. Johnny broke my heart. You forgot about Sammy. He's up down the road coming up to you. <laughs> Because they got men out here that will treat you like a flower. Just because you got the bad one. <laughs> so, hey, man, you just wait a little while. And God know what you need when you need it. Sometimes he wants you to get close to him first. And he let folk break your heart so you can put that rim up. Nobody crosses this rim again. 
This place is for God and God only. Amen. Period. And nobody steps over there no more. And I give it to God only. Amen. That's what I did with my life. Amen. The world took me to so much, nobody gets in the space where God is. Amen. Nobody. I put that there through experiences. Not that you don't love people. It's just that that's for God only. Quit me. When all else fell, I can go back to that space where God is. Right. Amen. Amen. God, my confidant. The one I can talk to and he won't judge me. He won't put me down. He will always help me. He know what I need and when I need it and how I need it. He's my friend. <laughs> but now he's my friend he's my father too yeah. he's everything to me yeah. somebody say man yeah. and that's where you got to put uh, look that's, where, that's how it got to be yeah. if you're going to trust God yeah. like, like that guy fixed my car and I got mad because I didn't tell him to do that but he did it because he said I was getting on the highway and he didn't want me to break down that's what he was thinking. So I got back there. I said, man, I ain't tell you to do that. I said, how much more I owe you? He said, don't worry about it. You can make payments. I was just looking out for you because uh, 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 I didn't want you to break down the road. Said, and then I said, all right. I left. So I, I called my pastor. He said, you fool. That's God looking out for you. <laughs> he said, you could have broke down the road in that dark country road with no toes at <laughs> he said, man, you don't know what God doing. He know everything. You don't know nothing. I said, I didn't look at it like that. He said, that's what the boy, you better look at it. <laughs> you better thank God for looking out for you when I couldn't see it. Yes, yes. You know, things hurt when they first happen. Yeah. But down the road, you're going to see why it happened. <laughs> you're going to say, well, thank you. <laughs> Anybody ever see somebody you like and then you just missed them and then down the road you see them again and say, thank God they didn't get with him. <laughs> somebody said, I did that. I said, Lord, thank you, Jesus. <laughs> I had a better crack in. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> somebody said, man, I said, God was looking out for me when I was looking out for myself. Thank you, Jesus. Look, and they went that way. They came to a certain water, and even they said, See, this is water. What do it hinder me to be baptized? And Philip said, If thou believest with all, see, see God needs that. This is what he needs right here. See, you, you try to get him half of it, three quarters of it. With all that what? You know, God talked to me because he know better. Oh! You have to tell your kid, don't do that because I've been through this. I know what's happening. Don't do it. And they do it anyway. Well, you the same thing with him. He tried to tell you something in the pulpit, talking to you, don't do this. Don't do that. And we still do it. We so stupid. I didn't say y'all. I said we. And, he, and then look. And after you learn your lesson, he still helped you. Fool, you could have to go through that. If we just would have listened to God. And he answered and said, I believe that Jesus Christ is what? And he commanded the chariots to stand still. And they what? Where'd he go? And what? And he what? You know why both of them went down there? Somebody, the eunuch had to be baptized by Philip. So he had to get in the water. You see that? That's what made me. I remember I had that, that, that horse thing. I was baptizing folks. This is what made me get to the pool. Because why? Philip went in the water with him. Who hit me? They got in the water together. And he baptized him. So I was sitting right there. And God told me to put the baptism pool right there. And I was broke. I went up, met y'all remember Ryan's? Ryan's was closing down. And I asked the man, 
can I get some of these chairs? He said, three dollar, you know, Chinaman. He said, three dollar piece. He had about 300 of them. I said, I want all of them. Give me money, get chair. I said, all right. So, was it you? No, it was uh, I gave I gave the chair to somebody. They, I think it was uh, Will. I took a picture of it. We put it online. This guy out of Texas come and bought them all for $10 a piece. Ten. Cash money. The man gave me $3,000. I was almost shaking with the Holy Ghost. I started speaking in tongues. <laughs> then I called Texas. And he brought that pool down with a heater. And that's how I got it in there. You know why? Just as soon as I thought about it, God stopped moving. That's right. He sure did. Didn't he? He gave me that money so quick. All because of this scripture. It jumped out at me. They both got in the water. And when they were, look, when I put the pool in, the whole spirit in the church changed. I can't explain it to you. But look, and you baptized here, and when they came up out of the water, the spirit, see, he got the Holy Ghost, caught away Philip, that the eunuch saw him no more, and he went on his way rejoicing. Who see that? He said, what hindered me? What's stopping you from getting baptized? What, you got a problem or something? God showed you the scripture. What more do you want? You should have been on your way rejoicing. Thanking God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. These folks coming out the Holy Ghost room now, they just... Halfway coming to church. And you got the Holy Ghost? Huh. When that girl gave me the Holy Ghost, I was happy. I was coming to church skipping. 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 <laughs> I couldn't wait to go to church. And I ain't never had that. <laughs> Your fire went out soon as you got it. <laughs> Smoke is drilling up in the thing. <laughs> Scared to tell anybody about Jesus. Who you think I'm preaching to you for? So you're going to go tell it. Go tell it on the housetop. Don't be like them guys. Everybody made excuse. Why they couldn't go. To the marriage. Amen. See, that's what we're getting for. We're getting ready for a marriage. Amen. Who hear me? Yeah. Anybody hear me? Yes, sir. What they call it? The ceremony? The marriage ceremony. That's not a marriage. No. Uh -uh. A marriage is when you get down, two people get down to the nitty gritty. When they start living together. All these little happy dappy, I love you, I love you, I love you. <laughs> but when you start living together, that's when you know people. You, you know they farts and <laughs> uh, who did it? When, when I was dating, you were scared to fart around them. Treat the fart. I said, I ain't know y'all fart. <laughs> she, hey, she back there said, Oh my God, no, if I said it. <laughs> you know, we act like we don't fart or something. You know what I mean? <laughs> Nobody fart. I'm, I'm special. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I should have changed it. Maybe I should say, You know, poop. What about poop? Does that sound a little better? No. Fart for the man. <laughs> you get up, breath thick, how you doing? Yeah. Give me a kiss. Hair everywhere. 
<laughs> we just dating all oh, you, you 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 had it on your clone, you couldn't you couldn't stop it. Now you ain't putting on nothing. Not even deodorant. <laughs> Nasty <as> self. <laughs> Especially a mechanic or stuff. Oh God. Am I in the right church? So God is God is getting us ready for this marriage. And the body represents the church, and the church represents Eve. Who hear me? And Adam represent the Christ. And we supposed to hook up after a while. To be in the marriage. So we could be with him forever. Somebody said, that's why we're in church, folks. Yeah. You, you forgot what you're here for. Oh, church is boring. Really? The world is boring, too. Amen. Keep on doing it over and over again. Right. Same club, same week, same this, same get-together, same at the power, same, same, same overnight, same, 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 same woman, same girl. Same people, same drug addict, different drug addict, another drug addict. <laughs> same party. If you ain't careful, you be doing what other people do. Thank you, Lord. Hey, you in a gay parade talking about you ain't gay. Hey, you, you marching with them. Get your little pink ribbon on. You just as gay as they is. When you go to the gay uh, parade, really, you're gay. <laughs> you're funny. Something wrong with you. This guy got caught at the gay bar, right? They said, what you doing in the gay bar? Somebody said, you go in there. True story. He said, man, I'll just go there and get, the, get discounts on the drinks. <laughs> Get discounts on a drink. I ain't going out like that, Jack. If I'm gonna get discount, I'm gonna steal me a drink at the store. That's a big discount. <laughs> Anybody hear me? I'm gonna grab me a 40. Look, put, look, put it in my face. I'll see you later. It run out. I told you because I've done that before. Back in the day. Who hear me? <laughs> Tell me you you was in that gay parade. You funny bunny. I just want to support him. Really? You against God? Whatever God against, I'm against. I'm against me because my flesh ain't no good. Somebody say, man. Because you know, we like that blame game. We like to blame everybody like Adam and Eve. Who see that? Did he preach the gospel? Yeah. Tell me what he preached. Jesus. Jesus. Over there in Matthew, he preached the gospel, they got baptized. He preached Jesus and they got baptized. <laughs> so the gospel is Jesus. He just gave you a prime example of who he was. Going to all the world and preach what? And that's just what he did. And Philip was a deacon. <laughs> he wasn't a preacher. He was a deacon. Tell him, God called you to preach. And you won't tell nobody about Jesus. Or it won't even bring nobody in here. You won't even hit the streets. Won't even keep up with nobody. The church ain't got lazy. Everybody wanna be a movie star. But they don't wanna they don't wanna pay the price to be one.